Yeah, I'm doing a pumper fire here today and using uh, fatwood for the tinder. We got a bunch of curls from the poplar, of course, here. Use those. And I got different graduated from uh, pencil edge size on up to uh, thumb size. Using this uh, outdoor grill because uh, not up in the woods. Poplars, uh, I got it from the neighbor's backyard a couple years ago when they downed the tree, and uh, it leaves a lot of ash, I found, but it's a pretty good wood. If it's dry enough, hopefully we got it dry here. I use the uh, Burst Class uh, recommendation for using the awl on the USA knife, US knife. Hopefully this wood's dry enough. I just uh, split it today, so uh, we'll see. It seems to be going better. Got three times the amount of prep as I should have, which is not only my idea, but bushcraft idea, and it's a good idea. Better get up to knee high. Of course, this makes it up higher, so. I have to get the flame up higher than this. But uh, the fat wood I uh, scraped off by uh, putting your knife o over it and then just scraping it and getting that real powdery stuff. And uh, that is what you saw cut on fire first, I think, and then the fat wood curls. And then I used the curls from uh, here. And it's definitely getting uh, about waist high now. So I'm going to down in here. I'll get my cover and that'll help some. Anyway, uh, a lot of wood left here and uh, that's the point of the whole thing. I've got uh, plenty of it left and I'll use it in the stove tonight. And uh, that's my second uh, split wood fire and uh, it took quite a while doing this but uh, 
It's very cool. Anyway, over and out.